how do their chums does I, Captain of the Steves. And today, chums, I'm jumping into Dragon's Dogma, and loading into my previous save. And we're going to be making for Glindor's place of training. I'm sure Glindor is some sort of chocolate, isn't it, over here in the UK? But anyway, let's jump on over into game and let's uh, get started on this little quest, shall we? Come to think of it. Was there not another task we were to see to somewhere nearby? Yes, there was. There's quite a few quests that I've got right now, none of which are timed. So I should be okay. We're going to be doing the gift of the bow, and we're going to be going there. We'll make our way there in time. As to whether it will be sooner or later, that is for the Arisen to decide. Exactly, my little pawny friend. And at the moment, you're over-encumbered, aren't you? So let's see if we can do something about that, shall we? Um, right, so you've got a load of bits and bobs here that I could probably sell of yours. So I think we're quite near to a vendor. Let's see if we can sell some of those wares of yours just to sort of sort you out, shall we? Oh, fudge! I didn't mean to do that! Awesome biscuits. I did not. I, I, I pressed the wrong button. Right. After you, arisen. I've all manner of arms for sale. Yeah. Oh, have yourself a look. I, I want to sell you stuff from uh, my pawn. Hopefully, I can sell it to you. There we go. I'll sell you that. And sell you that as well. Cool. Um, they're still quite heavy. Uh, we've got two camping kits. Um, I just sell one. There we are. That that's sorted her out, isn't it? Cool. All right. We'll be off then. Cool. I really didn't mean to draw my bow and scare the living fudge out of that person, to be honest. All right, so now we've got to head up to Lindor, wherever that is. Um, I'm trying to find it on the old map. All right. Oh, my days, it's all the way over there. All right, fine. We're going there anyway. All right, well, let's try and get out of this city then. This looks like an exit, if I ever did see an exit. Was just taking us deeper into the castle hold. Oh fudge! There's a griffin. We shall have to find a way to reach it. Not right now, we won't, love. All right, we're just gonna press on out, and we're gonna go to wherever we've got to go to. This is freaking insanely large, isn't it? Okay, so I'll go over that bridge and then take a left. All right, fine. I don't even see the bridge. This world is freaking vast. It's massive. Alright, well it looks like we're actually heading out at night as well, which is, is probably not the best idea that I've ever had, let's face it. Have I gone past the bridge? No, I'm about to get to the bridge now. I heard a rumour that this land was once a kingdom of beastrons. Really? really? Quite. Though no oh, definitive records remain. It's In get... another world, I learned that a forgotten riftstone lies nearby. Shall I escort you there, Master? Um, I think we've set out at night, which is a stupid idea of mine. And I think we're going to get completely annihilated in a moment by night creatures! Oh, look, we found a bug, though. At least we can see those nice and easy in the night. Okay. Um, I know that there's a way to put on my lantern. Oh, there we go. There. I doubt ice will be of any Where? I can't even see them, it's too poxy dark. I'll be with you in a trice. Take that, Wolf. Hang in there. You'll pull through. Got him. That was thrilling. It was, it and I high fived him. Feel so alive. Okay. Alright, fine. Um whatever. Whatever, whatever. Yeah, okay. Um Right. Where do I go now? Because oh, across the bridge, I need to take a left. But I don't see a path to the left. Hold on. It's just over this way. What the fudge is he doing in the woods? Are these bad guys? Oh my days! How the hell do you combat ghosts? I, grant you roaring flame. I think they killed that man. I don't think we can kill ghosts, can we? Apparently we can. I went up a level anyway. I should not have ventured out at night, people. Okay. Get out of it! I don't like ghosties. Too fast for you. 
I have no idea. I'm just firing arrows into nothingness. I don't think my arrows actually do damage. But luckily, one of my pawns is doing damage. So I think we press on, people. Dang it! I didn't want to stop at the inn. Because the inn... I think there's a campfire over there. Because the inn is where I need to go to progress the main story. And I want to do all my side missions. Harpy! Oh, my dice! Take that, Harpy of Hell! Maybe it wasn't a harpy. I think we're okay. We can just carry on. It, it's got yeah, harpy it. stuff to do. We well and true. Did we? Well, I'm sure there's still room for improvement. Take that in the eye! And that! And that! Right. Hiya! One of us has been drenched. Yeah, uh, you get drenched in oil, then they set you on fire. The little gits! Gotta just take them out quickly, you know? Right, now we could set camp here, I think. Yeah. Okay, make camp. Here we go. Yeah, modest camping kit. Yeah, and we're going to rest until morning, because sod that. Not, I don't want to fight any more ghosties. Okay, so interact with this. Again. Oh, for fudge sake, just let me interact with it. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. Rest until we'll morning. Yeah, you go do that. Right, I'm gonna have a cup of tea. It's a lovely cup of tea. Got my own brew of tea. Yeah, in fact, when I'm editing, I would have put it up on that black screen you just had there. Check it out if you want a Captain Steve's brew of tea. Okay, well, let's head on over to the old rift. Let's let's make that. Now um, there's a worthy prize. I'm not. Would you shut it? I'm trying to talk to my audience. All right. Well, there's, there's something going on inside of here. Oh, okay. Anyway, what I was saying is, yeah, I've got my own brew of tea. It's quite a wonderful, lovely brew of tea at that. Very oaky breakfast English noty tea. There we go. Got some explosive arrows now. Anything out on here of aught? Yeah, no, not really. Hello, mate. Wonder if there's anything on the top of this tower that's worth getting. That's the only thing is a lot of the chests in this game. Yes, you sometimes find yourself quite some lovely treasure, but it's it's few and far between. And sometimes you can go out your way to get these chests, and because you haven't got no full damage, you spend a long time just backtracking all the way back down the blinking tower. Or at least that's what I find anyway, people. There's a chest. What chest? I'll take a look inside. You found a chest. You found waking powder in a chest. Okay. All right. Well done, you. All right. Well, let's let's head back down then. You see what I mean? Now I've got to backtrack on myself, all the way back down here. Cool. Well, it looks like my uh, team has found quite a lot of stuff that I missed out on. Uh, I've got to go down the next set of steps as well. Here we go. Let's head on back out into the world, people. Okay, right, well, how much further I've got to go? Oh, my freaking good God. Okay, I'll tell you what. I'm going to head up to that marker where I need to go. And if I encounter anything awesome, I'll be sure to let you know. Okay, chums, I've been travelling for some time. I explored a cave and I've come across these Saurians now. These are like lizard people. They're pretty quick. Pretty nasty as well. If you can hit them in the tail and sever their tail, that's probably the best way to take them out. I have to admit, the hound is making short work of them. There you go, we severed the tail. And he's dead. They do give you quite a lot of materials. Beast skin, mainly. Heck yes, high five! Bit of patter cake. Now, I would say that inside of Dragon's Dogma, the first outing, the encounters were much further apart. I'm encountering something every five seconds, and it's mainly freaking goblins, to be honest. And although that we're going up levels quite quickly at this early level, I'd imagine they're gonna, it's going to get quite tedious 
traveling, especially without hardly any fast travel in this world. Yeah, you pick... have me lead. No, I just wanted you to pick ah. stuff up that I can't be asked to. Anyway, I'll see you when I get there, people. Oh, John, something big is happening. Holy fudge, what's that? It's a Minotaur. Well, we set him on freaking fire. Just let loose a couple of normal arrows for now. Get my stamina back. Then I'm going to use my new attack. Sayonara! Okay. Boom! Okay. Doing quite a lot of damage. Just to get it back up again. Let's do my charge shot one more time. Pow! In the freaking face, mate. Oh, I thought there was another one up there. It's just a buffalo. Have we got him? I know he's down there somewhere. I can't see him because the bushes. He's not dead yet. Yeah, he's not dead yet, mate. Look out, Arisen. We're under attack. I noticed. Holy fudge. Oh, no. He killed me. He freaking killed me. After all of that. Oh, you're having a laugh. Oh, dang it. He hit me with one hit kill. My hand was tremble on the string if it were me. But I expect you'll do just fine. Okay, well, I've come back in again. Then follow me. How far away is it placed us? Well, this is where... Is this is where he was. Where is he? There he is. We have no means of exploiting okay. our enemy's weakness. Well, give us Fire's Blade again. I grant you Fire's Blade. I guess. Well. Look out, Arisen. We're under attack. I've noticed. Whoa. Show no mercy! You know what? I'm going to use that. I've got a book thing, haven't I? That I'm never going to use otherwise. How do I use this then? Use. How do you use it? Okay. I have no idea what I just did. Okay, all right, yeah, lightning attacks, I've got it. Let's do the sweet dire shot. I... Get him! Come on! I think he's on his last energy bar. Heck no! Keep pummeling him! I'm using my sweep shot on him now. It's like a medley of arrows. I need to be careful because I'm going to get exhausted though. Come on, he hasn't got much energy. You freaking got him. That's for killing me five minutes ago. You freaking git. Holy mackerel, that was a battle, wasn't it? There you go, that's my first freaking encounter with a Minotaur. Look. No sense letting the enemy gain the upper hand. The early griffin gets the worm. Early, early griffin gets the worm. I've heard that a little bit too often now. Right, how far away have we got? We're, we're getting there, we're nearly there. I think we go past this, hmm, maybe we could go across this first bridge. Oh, he's got spikes on his shield. Got him. It's hard to spot the others, they're in the long grass. Oh dear me. 
They're on the... Who done that? Oh, it's you, you freaking little git bag. Now die. Okay, there we go. We got them. All right, guys. Well, there's... I think there's a bridge down this way, maybe. Oh, no. I think we have to get up and round. Well fond of picking things up, aren't you? Yes, I am rather fond of picking things up. Yeah. I'm going to get quite full, though, and overladen if I keep doing it. Oh, fudge off, budgie regards. Sometimes the flame effects and stuff makes it so it's hard to see what you're actually hitting. Okay, right, I've downed that one. Yeah, I'll knock them out of the sky. You kill them. I'll try and knock them out of the sky anyway. Freaking old still, you freaking git. Ah, there you go. That shut you up, didn't it? Yeah, I got you. Okay. Let's okay. For the same result with our next attack. All right, fine. We got him. Okay, let's go across the bridge then. And hopefully we'll be near to our mark. Oh, there's another bridge up there. That looks beautiful up there. Look at that. Oh, this is freaking lush. I mean, look at this. Beautiful Come weld. Think of it. Yeah. Some masters rearrange their party at the drop of a hat. Well, I don't. What is that tower? Nay. Fudge off! Oh my god, there's loads of them! Fudge your neck! Just hit it! There we go, we've got him. No, you don't. Oh, no. She's going to put us to sleep if we're not careful, people. Oh, for fudge's sake. Fudge off. Where are you? There's one more. Missed him. Missed him. Yes, get him. I grant you roaring flame. Okay. It's flying through the trees. I can't hardly see the dang thing. Ah! Oh, still. Freaking! Just die! You annoying freaking thing! Sometimes I kind of wish I had auto lock on, you know what I mean? It takes some real skill tracking these freaking flying we gits. By the skin of our teeth. Yeah. What fails to destroy us only enhances our chances against future adversaries. Really? You think so? Right, I'm glad. I don't share your optimism. Oh, for fudge's sake. Oh, we got... There's goblins here and wolves. Die! Ah, oh, no! Get out of here, freaking wolves! Holy mackerel! Have we gone the wrong way, though? What are you fighting, exactly? Okay. Damn goblins. Am I? I'm not. Oh, my pawns are. I can't hardly see them. Oh, what the fudge? There's a bandit amongst them as well. And wolves. Holy fudge, we've got a whole army of shite against us now. Throw him. Is he dead? He is. Good. Are you dead? You are. Okay. Alright, now we must be near to our mark now. Apparently we've got to head north. Okay, can we go up this old bridge? Is that where we're supposed to go? Hard to say. I guess we are. We're going up here. I think I'm slightly over-encumbered, people. 
Uh, are you a bad guy? You are a bad guy. Oh no, he's, a, he's an elf. Hi ya! Yeah, you're dead. Is this the elf I came to see? I don't think this it is. Yeah, many thanks. You're welcome. Thank you. I don't know what that is. Well, thank you. Speaker of a strange language. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. Elvish. Okay. Yeah, you, you do that. You do that, yeah. You don't have to ask. Okay, right. Why are you waving at me like a crazed being possessed? Okay. I'm going up here then, are we? Fine. And then where, Athena? Exactly. Are you taking us to our mission marker? I hope you are. I don't fancy going too far off track, because... Alright, cool. We are. We're following you right now. Aha! Oh, this is freaking lovely, isn't it? Look at this! And we're finally there! Well, it feels like an adventure every time I play this game. True to your word, you have come. I have! Let us begin at once, um... I should like to observe your form first and foremost. Uh, uh, so, so stand here and take your aim at yon targets. Okay, yon will. Okay, right. You have my gratitude. I learned much from you just now. Really? I only shot one arrow. In fact, I have made a discovery. What's that? Unlike those of Elven Maid, those crafted by other races are designed for keen aim. Is that not so? Well, what do you invent the elvish ones for exactly? But yes, that's correct. But I can see this is no revelation for you. I expect you thought this design common to all those, yes? Exactly, yes. Not so for those of elven make, however. Really? Our bows are crafted to guide not the hand, but the heart. How? Mayhap you will find the sentiment strange. But such is the perspective of elven kind. Oh, nice. We are taught that arrows loosed with proper form will strike true. As if it is all a matter of poise. Okay. I admit, I find it rather baffling myself. Perhaps that is why my bowmanship has failed to improve. Okay. Yet with this bow, I begin to understand. Let us see if I fare any better now. Give it a go. Huzzah! There you go. What a feat. There you are, yeah. Go on. I, I, I can hardly believe it. Every last arrow found its mark. Dead centre. There you are. This marvel is, is nothing at all like an elven bow. The design allows for ease of aim and steadfast flight of each arrow. Yeah, just don't try and shoot a harpy. They're a pain in the backside, mate. Such a difference. May have mm -hmm. I more suit to a bow foreign make than one of my own peoples. Well, it, it happens. I won't worry about it, mate. It's a strange thought. Yeah. But how else to explain it? My arrows have not soared so true in all my days. Well, I'm glad you're happy with it. I'd nearly given up on myself. Yet it would seem I am not without talent after all. No, surely not. My performance of this bow has divested me of such doubts. There you are. With the ingenuity of this design. If only my people would take heed. Well, maybe show it to them or something, I don't know. It is all very well to talk of honing one's form. But why should we not perfect the tool so integral to our customs? No, why not? We I mean, can give it a go. I am decided. I shall take this bow back to the arbor. Nice. With this as my weapon, I have no doubt I shall pass my trial of archery. Well, I wish you all the best of luck, Glindor. It seems Sir Glindor's doubts no longer plague him. Nice one. May his newfound confidence see him through his trial of archery. There you go. Good luck with your trial of archery. With the bow you gifted me in hand, I no longer dread being put to trial. I almost look forward to it. I shall attack my training with renewed vim. Nice one, sir. Okay, right. Uh, claw them into shape. 
Procure weapons. Oh, no, we won't do that one yet because that's a massive backtrack. We might as well go to the Seat of Sauron now. So we need to speak to Captain Brat at the tavern at night. Okay. So we do that one then. So we're going to be going back and we've got to speak to him at night time. Okay. Well, it's a long walk back all the way back to the capital city now. It's all the way down freaking there. There's the cave that I explored on the way here. I didn't go all the way through. I'd imagine it's got an exit point somewhere over here, maybe, or over there. Who freaking knows? But anyway, I'm going to head all the way back to the capital. And I'm going to save my game there. Now, I'll reconvene when I get there, people, if I get there. I'll let you know if I die or something crazy happens. Okay, well, after a long, audious journey, I am back at the actual castle keep. Now we need to go to the inn, so I might be able to go this way. I'm surprised just how busy it is, even at this late of hour. Okay, let's head this way then. Would you mind coming over here? Um, no, I'm 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 heading towards the mission marker at the moment. Somewhere around here. This ladder can take us to new heights. You probably can, but no, stop messing around. We are just here to do our mission. I want to open this poxy box first, though. Ah, oh, ah, four hundred gold. Let's head into the bar then. Oh dear. Well, there seems to be a bit of a uh, fisty cuffs. Don't hit a woman. Holy fudge. Okay, um, we're here to speak to the guy next to these guys having it out. Um, do we just do we just not intervene? Your Majesty. Hello. Your timing is impeccable. Cool. I just thought to call for you. Right, brilliant. Well, those two people that were fighting have stopped, thank fudge, because that was getting overly violent there. It's not a matter for prying ears. Pray, let us speak out here. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. You will want to hear this. It is information of great import. Well, tell it then. Tell it. It is not a matter for prying ears. Pray, let us speak out here. Okay, where do you suggest then? Go on. I come with. If you please. All right, we're off. Just here. All right. Fine. Okay. As I informed you when last we spoke, the palace is filled with the Queen Regent's sycophants. Right. Should Deesa denounce your Majesty as a false arisen, few would elect to doubt her. Okay. Yet if we are to prove your identity, I believe there is no occasion more suitable than the coronation. Cool. It was delayed so that the sovereign, that is, the false arisen, could convalesce in the palace. But the date has now been set. Damn the date being set! Yes. The central players in the court ought all be in attendance. It would be a fine opportunity to display your majesty's power. Okay, cool. Sounds good. None would be able to deny that you are the true arisen then. There is a problem, however. Entry to such an event is limited to the chosen few. Okay. Only select members of the nobility and citizens who have contributed greatly to Vermont's continued prosperity will be granted entry. So I need to pay my way in, is that what you're saying? If your majesty is to be counted among them, you will need to attend to a number of tasks. Pray, allow me to summarize them for you. Right, he's going to be our mission giver, isn't he, for the foreseeable future. Tell me of Monster Cullen. Tell me of the Queen Regent. Tell me of the Magistrate. Okay. The citizenry have called upon my soldiers to cull monsters that plague the land. Okay. I dare s What say you? Yeah, I could do that. Might I ask for your cooperation in this matter? Sure. I thank you, Your Majesty. There are three locales that I've seen significant trouble of late. All right, cool. Well, I guess we're doing that next episode then, people. The first is Trevo Mine, to the northwest. We've had reports of goblins swarming in great numbers. Fine. Next is Half Village, west of Burnworth. I believe soldiers have already been dispatched to call an infestation of Saurians there. Could do that, yeah, no Finally, problem. There is a call for someone to locate a group of soldiers tasked with delivering freight. They were last seen crossing the second bridge on the eastern edge of Vermin. Okay, cool. We have been charged with the felling of monsters. We have indeed, yes. I would... Shall we go then? So long as we're on the move, 
We'll get to the bottom of things sooner or later. I think what we should do. Can we stop the night, please, love? All manner of fine ales here. Now I just want to stop the night. to start you off. No, no. I would like to um stop the night if possible. All right. Okay. Always a pleasure. Okay, we pass time until morning, I guess. I I, do, I wanted to stop the night so I can get healed. We're, we're going to go to the inn, and we're going to stop at the inn, even though I've just passed some time and it's now daytime. Um, Because we need to be fully healed before we go take on a load of monsters. So I need to find the inn. All right, people, I'll be back once I've actually found the inn. Looking for the inn, I've had this person just ask me if I've got a spare moment, so I thought I'd just hit record I've again. People, and my instincts tell me you're of trustworthy ilk. Right, okay. You seem shady as fudge, mate. I'm in a bit of a quandary, you see. Okay, Mildred. I'll be gone for a week with no one slated to mind the house in my stead. Okay. Fear not, I only ask your name to list as a tenant. You needn't bother yourself with the cleaning, and I don't expect you to stay cooped up in there neither. Could this end up giving me a free bed to stay in? Heck yeah. I'd be much obliged if you'd simply consider my home a waypoint on your travels. Okay, fine, yeah. Some Do that. Feeling? Yeah, totally. Then come on by and have a look-see. I've taken the liberty of marking the location on your map. Well, thank you very much, Mildred. Okay, um... Right. Mildred at her home. Pray follow me. I know the way, so there's no chance of our getting lost. Uh, okay, all right, we're following Athena then. I'm coming. We've right, arrived. we've arrived. Okay, well that was easy. Thank you very much. You've come. We Glad have. To see you, friend. Nice one. Okay, cool. So, what say you? Would you care to live here in my absence? Yes, definitely. As I said, many thanks, friend. Cool. You, I could count on you. I'll stop by again in a week's time. But till then, I still farewell. Don't, I still don't trust her, to be honest. But um, all right. Well, thank you. All right. I'm going in then. We will find much better rest in an abode than out in the elements, methinks. I think so too. Let us make good use of it while we can. Okay. Rest till morning. And am I, I going to get? No issue for am I sleep, going to get all of my health back? Let's see if I get. Let's see if anyone's hired my pawn as well. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Let's see if that's a thing. Ha ha! Your pawn has returned from beyond the rift. I guess she has. She received a thumbs up and a heart. Cool. And she defeated a cyclops. That's what she wanted to do. Okay, you have received equipment. Somebody's given me some equipment. Oh, okay. Cool. Well, thank you very much. We've got that. Oh, it looks like she's got a new headpiece. That wasn't... Thank you. Whoever gave me this. So the gift giver was Ghost. Thank you very much, Ghost. And Ewol as well. Gave us a camping kit. Sent to storage. Might as well put that in storage. So there you go. Tazar. Thank you very much, Tazar, for that thing. And Ruby for that. And Ghost for that. And Ewol for that. Freaking lovely. Uh, okay. So I, I can view profiles as well. Matt the Low. Thank you there, Matt the Low. I know Matt the Low. View profile. Ghost Light. Oh, Ghost Light's playing this as well. Oh, this is freaking awesome. And we got Mark Powers. Thank you, Mark Powers. And there we go, Red Hulk as well. Thank you. Okay, Coolio. That's, that's awesome. Set Pawn a new quest, I guess. Okay, I, I, I don't really need to do this, I suppose. But there we are. I don't think I've got any new ones on. Oh, okay, we have more. Yeah, yeah, do that. Um, I'll give... I don't know. One of those. Warming salves. There you go. Oh, okay. There we are. Done. Done, diddly, and done. Well, nice one. You'll not believe the journey I've had. I bet. I wager my horizons are broader than ever. Oh, 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 that is so freaking sweet. Thank you guys that have taken Phoenix out. To start the day off. Oh, that's brilliant. Off we, go, then. we will do. Rested, I trust. Oh, look. We've got something in here. Oh, we can deposit stuff. Okay, right. Well, what's weighing me down? Because I am really overburdened right now. 
Okay, um, I could put that in there, but we might need the camping kit as we venture out. I'll put all that in there. Okay, well, I'm going to sort out my inventory, people. I'm going to stick all this stuff in here. All the crafting gear can go in. There we go. I'm already weighing far less. Oops, I stuck a key in there. What's that? Seeker's token. Might as well put that in there as well. Got two fluted bows. They can go in there. I've got that equipped right now. Oh, I've got some rings I can equip. Cool. All right. Well, let's do um, let's do this lady as well because she needs to be sorted. Yeah. Anyway, I'll sort this out. And I'll be right back. Okay, chums. Well, I think I'm about good. That'll do us. Um, combine items as well. Let's see what we can combine. Okay. That'll do us. I think. Yeah, we've got a rotten scrag of beast meat. Might as well chuck that, to be honest. Yeah, we don't need that anymore. Let's um, discard that. And, uh, yeah, this one is going to go off relatively quickly too. So I'm just going to give that to somebody that usually takes damage. He's usually running around doing nothing. So, well, battering stuff. I might as well use this to uh, make myself carry additional weight. And I think we're ready for our next adventure. Ah, I could do with equipping this, maybe. Offers greatest boost to strength of bow attacks. Yeah, I guess. Equip that. And what about this one? Strength. Again, what's this one? Slightly boost. I might as well put that on my left hand. There we go. And I'm going to give this one to Phoenix. And go over to Phoenix. And I might as well equip that. Done. And yeah, I think we're now ready for our next adventure, people. And I think this is a decent point to stop. So as you go into system, and we go to save, and return to title screen. There we go. Lovely jubbly. So people in the view of us, hopefully you've enjoyed this little mini jaunt. I mean to say mini jaunt. We went on a freaking adventure and a half there. Went off the beaten track, saw an elf, got killed by a bloody Minotaur, killed the Minotaur, headed back to town, picked up some decent quests. It's all happening right here. Yeah, join us next time as we go cull some monsters. Awesome! Thank you for watching. Salute to Goodbye, goodbye, and goodbye again, people. <laughs>